Now that we understand relative phase, let's introduce two new gates, the S and T gates. The S gate adds a relative phase of pi on 2 radians. The T gate adds a relative phase of pi on 4 radians. If we take the conjugate transpose of the two matrices of the two gates, we get their inverses. For the S gate, we can see that applying S dagger adds a relative phase of negative pi on 2, which is the inverse of the S gate. This means that if we apply a S gate, then an S dagger gate, we are back in the same spot, meaning the S dagger gate is the inverse of the S gate. We also have the T dagger gate, which is the same thing as the S dagger, but adds a relative phase of negative pi on 4 radians instead, meaning it is the inverse of the T gate.